It's 9th February and it's Sunday. We overworked today to complete the test of our 45 kilowatt hour battery on BMW i3. Yesterday, before getting off work, we had drove for 307 kilometers. The SOC displays as zero on the dashboard, but the voltage display still got 333 volts. And according to our experience, there are still should be half around 15% electricity. So we will complete to drive today to check how many kilometers we can still drive when the dashboard displays 0% SOC. Let's find out together. Let's go. Okay, let's check the dashboard. 307 kilometers have been traveled, just as same as yesterday. SOC 0.5%. Energy economy. The temperature is only 2 degrees Celsius, also very cold. Okay, let's check the battery status. The voltage is 334 volts, SOC is 0.4%. The static voltage difference is 12 millivolts. Perfect, right? Let's start to test on road now. Now we start the vehicle. You can find the dashboard still shows it's in power limit. Okay, now we have traveled 331 kilometers. Now the dashboard shows it's in very serious power limit and we can only drive around 50 km per hour. We can only drive with this speed and cannot accelerate to drive a higher speed. Now we have traveled 334 km. Although the dashboard is still in the ready situation, but even we explore the pedal, we hardly can drive now with a very slow speed. Let's check the battery status. You can find the voltage now is 320 volts. The minimum cell voltage is 3.3 volts. It's in completed discharge now. If we need for towing, we need to turn around in the next corner so we will try to start the car now to check if we can still go for that corner and turn around. Uh oh, the car cannot start now. No matter how we blow the paddle, it just cannot drive now. Now we install the hook for towing. It's a Chinese version, Nissan Leaf Z1, which we are towing us back to the factory. The Z1 is towing us back to the factory. It's not far away, so I think it's no problem. Let's check the BMW i3 dashboard now. We are in D mode and uh, it's in kinetic energy recovery. Let's check the voltage when in kinetic energy recovery. Now it's in kinetic energy recovery. The current now reaches to 71 ampere. The cross speed is accelerating. We have now arrived at the factory and we will charge the BMW i3 now. Okay, now the car is in charging. The charging light is twinkly. Let's check the dashboard in charging. It shows 366 kilometers. This is the estimated current when the battery is fully charged. It means that the battery can be fully charged uh, tomorrow, this time. Please ignore this time, we have not set this date. Okay, let's check the battery status. The voltage now is 334 volts. The current in charging is 9 ampere. 
It is a 3.5 kilowatts charging power. The voltage difference is 9 millivolts. It just shows the DC current is 9 ampere and the charging finish time will need 15 hours. It's estimated we will complete the charging at 44 past 2 in tomorrow morning. Okay, that's for all the data. The battery in charging looks normal. The charge time completed at around 2 o'clock in the morning. So we set a phone to record the charging, the whole charging process. This screenshot was taken when the charge is fully completed. You can find the charge time needed is 14 hours. The electricity charge is 48 kilowatts hour. Today is 10th February. After 14 hours charging, now the battery is fully charged. You can find the charging light turns green means it's fully charged. Now we pull up the charging gun. Plug in the OBD2 and let's check the dashboard readings. Okay, let's check the dashboard readings. Now the battery is fully charged. 337 kilometers have been traveled. This is the kilometers we have been traveled during the past two days. It shows 359 kilometers remaining cuisine range on the dashboard. As you see, now it's 100%. Energy economy. The temperature outside is 6 degrees Celsius. It's a bit warmer today. Let's check the charging status. The charging set of the original car can only be charged at 3.5 kilowatts. So the charging speed is really slow. It takes us 14 hours to fully charge the battery and the charge electricity is 48 kilowatts hour. This is the charge money. Let's check the battery status. The voltage has been charged to 401 volts. The voltage we start from charging is 334 volts. Now have been charged to 401 volts. The SOC is 100% now. Capacity 129 ampere. Cell voltage is 4.1 volts. The static cell voltage difference when fully charged is 7 millivolts. Perfect. Okay, after three days of completed testing, we have completed the current test of our 45 kilowatt hour battery on BMW i3 and also the fully charging test. The current of our 45 kilowatt hour battery on BMW i3 is 337 kilometers and the charging we tested is also normal. So let's look forward to together our battery upgrade solution for BMW i3 together. Thank you.